V-Ray Next is now compatible with Maya's Playblast animation preview option. Now you can start a Playblast with Viewport IPR enabled to see a rendered preview version of the animation frame by frame. To see how it works, let's scrub through the timeline here and view the animation we currently have. Yeah, I wouldn't want to be driving on the road behind this guy. Let's return to the start of the animation and right click on the timeline to test the Playblast without running V-Ray yet just to ensure the animation works as planned. I'll set the quality to 50, and if I click Play Blast, you'll see that the Play Blast loads with just the standard viewport preview and no rendering. Okay, let's return to the first frame of the animation, and this time start the viewport IPR by clicking the V-Ray icon in the top left corner. We can also enable the NVIDIA AI denoiser in the viewport by clicking the button to the right, which will very quickly denoise our rendered play blast and give us an even smoother result. Now, let's open the Play Blast Options menu again. This time, we'll increase the quality all the way to 100, and just make sure the scale is set to 0.5, so our preview will be 50% of the size of the viewport. Now, we can simply click Play Blast and wait for the animation to render. You'll see as each frame is rendered, we get a nice preview of it in the viewport, so we can monitor its progress and get a feel for our scene. And when it's done, the rendered animation will automatically open in your default video player so you can watch it. Now you've seen how using V-Ray Next you can quickly get rendered previews to help you make decisions faster and save time when working with animations in Maya.